Thousands of firms from around the world are back in Barcelona to show off their state-of-art mobile and communications technology and services. Artificial intelligence once again takes the center stage. Our Moon Hae Ryeon has more. Europe's biggest mobile and telecommunications trade show is back. The 2024 edition of the Mobile World Congress hosted in Barcelona every year, kicked off on Monday local time. The theme for this year's four-day event is Future First, embodying six different sub-themes such as 5G and AI and stretching beyond the mobile industry to digital transformation overall. Around 2,400 firms from 200 countries around the world are expected to showcase their products and services this year to 95,000 visitors. Among the firms unveiling their latest new technology is South Korean tech giant Samsung Electronics, with its new Galaxy Ring that tracks health data in your sleep. While attendees at MWC are unable to actually try the units on display, the product is due to hit stores sometime later this year to join Samsung's lineup of wearable technology. Another reveal at MWC 2024 from domestic telecommunications firm KT is the intelligent urban air mobility traffic management system that assists in the safe operation of urban air mobility vehicles. UATM digitally replicates real-world UAM operations by integrating digital twin technology and AI and enhances safety based on numerous data analyses and simulations. Meanwhile, China's participation in the event is also garnering attention, as its biggest companies, including Huawei and Xiaomi, did not participate at CES 2024 last month, amid growing competition in U.S.-China technology sectors. With AI being a central theme this year, Xiaomi debuted global sales of its Xiaomi 14 smartphone, which integrates AI technology for searching photos, translation services, and taking meeting notes. Chinese technology firm Honor also launched an AI smartphone with an eye-tracking feature that enables users to open apps simply by moving their eyes. And in true MWC spirit, five telecommunications firms from around the world, including South Korea's SK Telecom, signed a contract on the first day of the event to establish a joint venture developing AI technology. Moon Hye-ryeon, Arirang News.